there's a metaphysical principle underneath that vocabulary word timeline that's quite subtle and unfamiliar to modern thinking. But basically, it's rooted in uh, a quantum mechanical understanding that reality is a relationship and that what exists in the sense, in the Newtonian sense of existing, like there it is, whether you're looking at it or not, at point X comma Y comma Z at time T, it's either there or it isn't. In quantum mechanics, that's nonsense. Uh, whether it's there in a fixed spot depends on the measurement, on the interaction between that and an observer. So what's true of a particle, then we extend that both metaphorically, but also not met just metaphorically to this entire world, the present, the past, the future. We would like to think as modern Cartesian thinkers that whatever happened in the past, either it happened, you know, or it didn't happen, but there's an objective fact of the matter outside of our consciousness. And the idea of a timeline says, no, actually there are multiple pasts, each of which co-resonates with a state of consciousness and a state of narrative, a, state of, a set of agreements among humans. And that as our consciousness shifts, the past changes. And this may take the form in our experience of new discoveries. For example, recent discoveries that megaliths and, and construction sites that were created way before we used to think that human beings were capable of such things. So is it that we've just discovered new things? Or is it that our belief system has changed into resonance with these things that we now discover and that they've been produced into our realm of experience? And even trying to make that distinction is itself part of the metaphysics of Descartes. Basically, the idea is that the past is not fixed either. That reality, to quote Orland Bishop, reality is not a given. It is a process. One timeline could be something very dystopian going into the future. And, and it includes a certain present, it includes a state of our being, and it includes a past. And as we heal and make these changes in our relations, we shift into a different timeline with a different future and a different past.